It's been a month since a quote in the Brainerd High School yearbook was discovered that made direct threatening comments regarding President Donald Trump. Clayton Castle sat down today with Brainerd Superintendent Lane Larson to discuss the current status of the investigation. The end of the school year is almost always a joyous occasion for students, faculty, and staff. However, on May 16th, the Brainerd High School community was faced with a controversy surrounding its yearbook when a quote from a student was published stating, I would like to behead him, I do not like him. The quote was in reference to United States President Donald J. Trump. It's been almost a month, and the Brainerd Public School Superintendent says that the investigation has been completed. The information um, report that we have received back, we have gone over with the Board of Education and um, we have now started with some of the disciplinary proceedings. Although the investigation is concluded, disciplinary actions have not yet been decided. However, it's not just the student who may be facing disciplinary action. The yearbook faculty advisor may also be disciplined. Once again, that would be part of the disciplinary action that the school district is undertaking. And due to the collective bargaining agreement, um, we have to work through this grievance period of time. Um, and it, if a, a grievance isn't filed during the period of time, then that final disposition of discipline will be identified. Otherwise, it would be after any arbitration took place if a grievance was filed. As a result of the investigation and situation as a whole, the district will be reviewing the policies of the yearbook staff to assure that this never happens again. The comments that came in the yearbook were not reflective of the district mission um, or anything having to do with how we believe personally as a school district. We have a wonderful, wonderful school district and um, we know a mistake has been made and, and we will, are dealing with that. We are in the process right now of looking at the policy for our student publications and we are going to do everything in our power to ensure that this doesn't happen again. Now, while the district's investigation has concluded, there's no word yet on the status of the investigation being conducted by the U.S. Secret Service. Reporting in Brainerd, Clayton Castle, Lakeland News. And Lakeland News will continue to follow the story and will bring you the latest when disciplinary actions are announced. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.